Welcome back. You're watching Business 360. Now, India saw 190 new COVID infections with active cases marginally increasing to a little over 3,400 cases in the last 24 hours. No deaths, importantly, have been reported. Meanwhile, the insurance regulator has reached out to the insurers on their COVID preparedness. The discussion is, however, only advisory in nature. Yash Chen now joins us uh, with more details. Yash, tell us, what are you picking up? Well, that's correct, Kashmir. So just last week, uh, towards the end of last week, the insurance regulators reached out to both Life, General and Standalone Health Insurance Companies, uh, you know, uh, putting an advisory sort of a notice to all these insurance companies, essentially, just to keep a check on the prepared, uh, preparedness if uh, in an eventuality that uh, the COVID cases in the country rise. Uh, as far as uh, life insurance uh, companies are concerned, the insurance regulator IRDAI uh, has asked these life insurance companies to to have an assessment of the capital that they have, the reserves that they've been, they've been keeping. Uh, this is essentially uh, to understand that if claims rise for whatever reason going ahead, uh, they do have enough capital to essentially handle those claims. Uh, to general insurance, the insurance regulators ask them to keep their hop hospital networks on standby in case health insurance claims increase. Also, uh, to essentially uh, focus on cashless claims as far as these patients are concerned. Uh, same goes for health insurance companies, but very important, as you mentioned, this is just an advisory. Uh, there is nothing that the regulator is forcing on in, or anything of that sort, but just an advisory to all these insurance companies. Right, Yash. Thanks a lot for that update. Here's a CNBC TV 18 exclusive.